So now we're gonna see the position uh, from different setup from the half guard. Remember when we back, if you back in some videos, we saw the video, you saw the setup from the half guard. So you're gonna make a shortcut from half guard to one of these position. So what are we gonna do over here? So we're gonna have the knees, the ground. I'm gonna use the lasso, especially no gi. There are no lasso and no gi. So it's a good to get in the lasso for you lock the person on the bottom. So use your head, touch your head on the ground. So, and then step back because he will not try to follow me, try to get my knees. My head in the ground, you block. So more I have my hand in the ground, more I can work in space. Okay, so if, if, but if I have the hands here, we're gonna be spinning and then he's gonna grab my leg. But if my hand is in the ground, he's gonna block. So the more I walk, but I keep his hook, my, his hook's in my back. I don't let him let go. So I keep his bull hook in my back to lock him. He's gonna scramble, even the half guard, now he doesn't have half guard anymore. Okay? Everything starts with the regular half guard. I'm gonna use my hand here, turn, touch the hand on the ground. Both hands on the ground. I'm gonna be stepping back and put all the pressure on my shoulder. He needs to escape from the half guard. Even if he tries to keep the half guard, when I do this, he's gonna escape. So the foot's gonna be here now. Look, my hand, close the elbow, I'm gonna grab his ankle, okay? Now look, my hand already in the knee, this hand gonna push his leg, behind my head, okay, I hold. If he stretch the leg now, so he already gives me the position. So I back to the guard with his leg over my hands over here. So he lock, I lock, I lock, he's lock himself and then I lock his leg. He's gonna try to escape, he can't escape anymore. So I have one arm to hold him. Now I choose, I have to see what he's giving to me. He push me, Remember, it's like a review all position. He push me, you can go over the arms to break his balance and sit down. He give you space, your hand can go here and sit down. He attack your leg, so your hand is gonna be going to north south. So, but then nothing he can do, even he stretch the legs, Look, more he stretch his legs because it's stuck, my hand gets easy to get out and to attack. So it's a pretty safe position for me. Actually, this is the update from the, from the position, from the 50-50. Because in the 50-50, arm control, his leg is uh, it's free. So he can use this leg over my head. He can use this leg in my shoulder. And I, can ha I have to be approaching to, to with this. He can, use the, he can try to use this leg as a hook in my knee, but I have to, then I have to touch my knee the ground to get out, because those can happen. I don't know what, how he's gonna use this knee. But when I have half guard, when I use the lasso, I lock his leg in my armpit. Move the hand to the ground. When I turn and I escape, and now I grab his foot, and then I lift his foot, put it behind the head. And then I lock, I walk to the guard. Now I lock him. He, he have no option to this leg. He's gonna try to move the leg, he gets stuck. He gets stuck. And then I walk close to him. Look, I, it's important. My knee, my hip, walk close to him. I'm gonna try to escape, I get close to him. I get close, there's no how for him to get out. And then I can choose head control, north south. See what the position is close to you. But the most important with this, and then with one arm, you control both of his leg and the hip. He push, he kicks you. The only thing you need is to start getting close. And more, you're gonna use your body weight. You're gonna use your, the gravity to help you to pass. No, you, you don't need speed strength. You don't need to use your power. You don't need to use your speed. There are no special, uh, like a super power to do the position, which is nice, which make, make it easy for old guys like me, past few Kawan's guard, <laughs> is to be here, controlling the leg, moving, and then you see, if you got a head control, if you wanna break the, the grips in the arm, but it's, use your body weight. And if your arm in the, in the here, it's pretty easy to get out. 
like as we, sh we saw before in the, in the sun position before, the way the leg it's across, it's not the, it's not the, the bicep slices. So you have no, not to worry about it. 